Hey everybody, we are working on a project today and uh, we've got some cracks in our con concrete. Now you saw um, a couple months ago we fixed the end of our drive where it meets the road and today I've got some cracks right down in here that actually go kind of deep. So we want to clean out the dirt, clean out the grass, um, kind of probably cut that off and then we're gonna fill it with a product called Rockite right here. We're gonna see how that goes and I hope you can follow along. So in order to use this product, it's supposed to harden in 30 minutes. We've got to, I think we've got to widen this up so we have a place to level it. This concrete is old. This house is well over 100 years old and the concrete, probably not that old, but it's definitely old. And we've got all kinds of cracks through here. I'm not gonna worry about those. I'm worried more about this because this fills up with water in the wintertime and it expands. So you can even see where it's filled in and then lifted up right here. So we're gonna cut this off and clean this out. We're gonna probably put in some drill holes just so it has a place for, the, for it to bond. But Rockite says it needs a half an inch and this here is a half an inch without an issue. We're probably a full inch, but I want this to have more of a smooth transition. And I think if I would cut it over in here, we could get a smoother transition. So we're gonna look at our handy dandy Hercules. This is what we used to crack the rock See, that's the dex pan. That's where we drilled in. So the drill worked down in uh, Kentucky and it worked real well. Okay, sounds like it's still functioning. We're gonna use this one right here. Okay. Okay, I think that actually went well and quick. Okay. Got some more gravel for the drive. Okay, any of this loose stuff is gonna come out. Let's see, we got grass, dirt. It, I can clean this out five times a year and it'll accumulate dirt in no time. Just from the trees, leaves, seeds, bees, everything. Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh, nice. When did they bloom? They bloom. They're always hmm. at the end of their Oh, right, right. Okay, now we're going to put the rock height in the bucket. Before we do that, we're going to get some gloves. Gloves. Now in this one, it said to fill it up. Um, reuse pretty much all of it. And then add enough water to make it plasticity. Well, not quite plastic. It needs to be pretty smooth. Pretty liquidy, it said. Fluidy. So we're going to fill this up to that point. Not sure what that consistency might be. This might be pretty close. So we had, this is actually just damp since we just used water on it. to go ahead and pour it in. Maybe I don't have enough. if I have quite enough. I may have to put some of these rocks back in. Uh, could you run down to the hardware and get another box real quick? This stuff right here. Do you need to take it? Filling cracks? Yeah. We're back. Did you miss us? Oh, yeah.
Have you ever repaired concrete? Have you ever used rockite? Leave your comments below. I want to know what your thoughts are. What would you have done different than this? Uh, I'd love to hear if you think this is going to work or if you think that uh, I should have done something different. Right there at the top of the triangle, I believe I am going to drill a circle in there as if it was steel that was cutting or if I was welding, something like that. I think concrete would work similar and stop cracks. Uh, anyhow, give me your thoughts. Be sure to write and comment below. I'd love to hear what you say. Take care. God bless. Thank you.